Gaga, goo goo, you stupid babies, good morning, and welcome to St. Patrick's Day on Mr. Keating Show, the only holiday where you can drink life-threatening amounts of alcohol to celebrate a guy who threw a snake in the ocean at something. The rules and customs of this holiday are sometimes vague to an outside eye. It used to be that you couldn't even eat meat on this day in reverence of the saint, but then at some point they just said, eh, fuck it, corned beef. Even this year, when it takes place during Lent, the church has basically said, eh, it's okay, man, you can eat meat, we're not gonna tell nobody. Irish culture has always been particularly vibrant, but instead of any of these customs or parades, today I want to focus on my favorite part of Irish culture, the music. Irish folk music slaps big titties. Because we want cabbage, man. My cabbages! With Irish folk songs, once you've heard one of them, you've heard all of them. But they're so fucking good that you still won't care. And this is probably due to the fact that every single Irish folk song can be classified in one of three categories. That's right. Every single Irish folk song. All of them will fall into one of these three distinct categories, some even more than one. Take a listen. Will this suffering ever come to an end? There were roses and the tears of the people ran together. But truly the most impressive part of Irish culture is their unfettered hatred for British people. So fuck your Union Jack, you know we want our country back. It's Ireland that Ireland it will be. The people of Ireland hate the UK so fucking much that literally an hour after Queen Elizabeth died, they had already written and composed, practiced and performed a new song about her death. All right, now that you've heard a few Irish jigs, it's time for my Keating quiz. I'm going to play a few more Irish songs, and it's up to you to figure out which of the three categories these songs fall into. Get ready. Here we go. That I must be close on 80. It's 30 years since you're gone. Kiss me, darling mother, drank a pint of beer, me grief and tears to smother, then off to reap the corn, leave where I was born, cut to stout black thorn, to banish ghosts and goblins, a brand new pair of brogues, rattling o'er the bogs, frightening all the dogs on the rocky road to double and one, two, three, four, five. Come on, shiver like in towns, come out and fight me like a man, show your wife how you won medals down in Flanders, and her how the IRA made you run like hell away. All right, guys, that was my quiz. The answer to all of them was C, fuck British people, because that's what all Irish songs are really about. Boys of Liverpool, when we safely landed, called myself a fool. I could no longer stand it. Blood began to boil. Temper, I was losing poor old Aaron's Isle. They began abusing. Harami, so says I wish a lady I look like. Galway boys were nigh, and so I was a hobble. And with the loud parade, joined in the affray, we quickly cleared the way. Oh. 